for people, viewers, and subscribers. Welcome back on this platform, BVI Channel One. Um, someone in his advocacy in the church, and I think that happened in the church that got my attention anyway. We had the man was telling every Nigerian to come out publicly to denounce Nigeria Constitution. Make no nothing saying I'm to come. Make no watch. This is the legality that the enemy is standing on to a presence. A senator from Southwest, I think he was even representing this place that year, stood on the floor and took it up. In his instruction, he cried and said, This is the only trouble that you have. And the Lord said, Destroy this openly before all Nigerians. Ask Nigerians in diaspora to do the same thing. Are you listening to me? Nigerians in diaspora all over the world get copies of these evil documents. Tear them into shreds. Reject their hold and bound. Remove the pain of evil that has led us down to poverty and underdevelopment and mark it and catch days. After this prophetic action, you shall be led to in the mighty name of Jesus. I commend the effort of Minas and all who have been struggling to have this done. But let me let you know. That the prophetic and the apostolic is to the assignment has come to pay. A robber and make a televosha in the dimension that Christ took the handwriting and the ordinances that were against us out of the way. This document of evil today is stressed. Not a single word of it shall hold. In the mighty name of Jesus, we tear it into pieces. In the mighty name of Jesus, the strength of your leader in it is destroyed. No son, no daughter of this nation shall be held by this government. In the mighty name of Jesus, we destroy the whole of your leader. In the mighty name of Jesus, 1999 constitution. We declare that you are an evil document and today we tear you before the assembly of the saints. We tear you before the church of Jesus in Nigeria. We tear you before Nigeria as a nation. In the mighty name of Jesus, we set the people of God free from this evil document. In the mighty name of Jesus, we declare it's a new nation. Do you agree with him? Every Nigerian across the globe should get a copy of this document of enslavement. The document that has impoverished and made the lives of Nigerians miserable. The document of, I don't know how to put it again, but it is the document that had all the Nigerian people's wahala bundled up in a book make a public denouncement of that constitution it has been a long time lnc have been saying it now this man has come up with one kind of i'll say suggestion and that is his opinion i personally i think i agree with him not i think i agree with him now what should be done is all Nigerians should choose a day, especially the LNC that had been an advocacy of uh, uh, advocating for the, um, you know, dishing away or complete overhauling of the Nigerian Constitution, 19, 1999 Constitution. I think they should come up with a date where every Nigerian across the world will come out with a copy and denounce that document of wickedness 
that document from the pit of hell that have contributed to the misery of every Nigerian anywhere around the world. You may not understand how that document have made your life miserable and have mortgaged the life of your children and those that are yet to be born. Tony Nadi, I think this is on your own, I will you on your own wing. I think you should take it up. I advise you to come up with a date and mobilize every night. I will broadcast it on this platform. I don't care. Let Nigerians come out to denounce that document of impunity that had made Nigerian lives miserable. And I think I have said enough. Now share this video. I'm signing out. I'm also Janet Peters, the voice of the people, the voice of God, and the voice of our ancestors. I have spoken. Subscribe, like, share, drop your comment. Let me have your opinion. Let this video go viral. Bye bye.